Okay, so what's up guys, I'm Pitsu Sammy and I'm back with another new video. So in this particular video, we're going to talk about 8D audio. Now 8D audio or rather somewhere some people also say it is called 3D audio. Basically the same concepts apply here. Now for this to work, make sure you have your earphones or headphones on. And then after that, listen to this particular voice. <laughs> And then as you listen to this particular voice, you can see that the voice goes from your left ear to your right ear to your again left ear again to your right ear. This is what we call as 8D audio and this is used in places where you can just give a little bit of ambient sounds to your entire video because when people are going to listen using a so-called earphone or a headphone they can actually feel the voices roaming around their heads which can give them a feeling that they're actually there in that particular place now i'm going to do this particular video in final cut pro but you can do this particular things in any other softwares out there as well so with that being said i'm going to just go into final cut pro and i'm going to just edit and show you guys how to make this particular 3d or 8d audio Okay, so before we jump into Final Cut Pro, I'm going to use all the sound effects which I made a video about few days back and I have extracted all these sound effects from my videos, from my own videos using the software called VideoProc. Now VideoProc is a very good software for conversion your, of your files or for converting your normal files into WV format files for creating sound effects. A video on that is already made and the link is there in the description for both video proc and the sound effects video as well. And with that being said, I'm going to use this particular sound effect. Okay, so although I have made all the sound effects used in this video on my own, there's a link in the description where you can find a list of many websites on the internet from which you can download many sound effects for your projects. The link is there in the description, do make sure to check it out. And with that being said, let's jump straight into Final Cut Pro. So this is Final Cut Pro and this is the sound effect which I'm going to use. And then after that, what you need to do is go to the effects control panel. But before that, I'm going to just show the audio animation so that you guys can see the keyframes really well. So go to the effects control panel right here. And what is needed is go to the pan section. And initially it will be at none. But here there are lots of other options and I'm going to choose left surround to right front. Now there are other options also here which are going to work perfectly and absolutely but I'm going to use this particular one because I felt that this particular one suits the needs and it is the most easiest of all. So with that being said, what you need to do is basically set keyframes. As you can see there is a particular waveform right here and what you need to do is go to the first section of your video or your audio where the audio just starts and set a keyframe and set the amount to the leftmost portion and then go few frames later set a keyframe again and set the amount to zero and then go few frames later again and set the amount to the rightmost portion then keep on alternating this so we are going left zero right then again right zero left keep on doing this until you're satisfied with your audio and in this case i'm going to just do it till here and i'm going to just extend the lengths of the keyframes so that it is a little bit more lengthier because it is a bit too fast in my opinion so i'm going to just adjust all the keyframes right here after that it is pretty much done just render this out make your video and listen with your earphones or your headphones this is necessary otherwise it is not going to work unless and until you guys have a stereo speaker in your system so use this and you are going to get awesome 3d audio or 8d audio in your videos so that is pretty much it. Mm -hmm. 